This is the riskiest TV show that I've ever made. And the reason it's really risky is um, it just it just might not work. These are the tests of a real psychic. Psychic can tell you, oh, you know, you're gonna have a bad day, or you're gonna have a good week, or you should totally go to college, or things like that. But can they tell you names, hard facts and names? I'm gonna try. But I am only making them believe that, because I am not a psychic, and probably no one is. Seriously, forget about this interview. Imagine that you could find someone in the world who could connect with people on the other side, people who have gone before you, um, and, and talk to them and have a real conversation and prove that they're really talking to them. That is the most intoxicating thing. We're working with celebrities, proper celebrities. Out of a 10, I give him a hundred. Paddy Doherty is genuinely the most lovely, natural, warm and loyal human being I've ever met in my life. How about that? I say that about all trained killers. <laughs> the interesting thing actually about The Unexplained as well is I'm going to reveal precisely how fraudulent psychics do what they do. So if you've ever been to one and you think they're a fraudster or a huckster or they're making it up, don't miss this one. Put it on in every TV in the house. I do talk to the other side, by the way. My wife's a Protestant. <laughs> Leading up to Halloween, why is The Unexplained relevant? Because it's Halloween. Next question. On to The Unexplained then. That's I'm not going to explain that one. <laughs>